Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Um, love could come up. It's just a general message. So um, thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Pisces. Thank you Lord God for blessing the Pisces with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what's going on. The seven of cups. Oh, there you go. <laughs> well, no, that's actually Scorpio. Um, lots of options. Um, seven deadly sins. Choose wisely. Um, so being overtaken, overindulging, not sure about anything, procrastination, not serious, not serious about ro romantic connections or relationships, a marriage. Um, somebody is questioning equality here. Something isn't equal. Somebody feels like uh, someone is a cheating spouse also. Uh, someone makes promises and they do not make good on these promises. They actually had no intentions of following through. Um, somebody is just in a place of out of control with the seven of cups needing to get in control how do you get in control you make a choice of these options which one what you doing um all right let's see the high priestess okay this sometimes could be you um uh, pisces somebody's got some singular plans or keep your plans to yourself somebody's also you know planning in secret uh, a decision needs to be made, says the Pisces, says not the Pisces, but the high priestess. Um, you know a decision needs to be made. Someone else knows a decision needs to be made. It could be up in the air. Someone could be not wanting to look at the fact that a decision needs to be made or walking around the elephant in the room, burying their head in the sand, um, crossing their arms, folding their arms, uh, crossing their legs, just not being open to the fact that something needs to be spoken about um focus on negotiation and moving forward and having a plan of action if you are trying to move forward with someone also this is like a secret lover too um secret lover uh someone fantasizes about the secret lover about a secret person or wanting to go to someone to one of their options or they, if they only have one option, they fantasize about that one person who is in the background, who is doing nothing. She doesn't have a real title because remember, the high priestess rests in the ethers. She's still in the, you know, the 5D in the heavenly realm. So somebody's connection to another person is not real. You know, um, it is real in the sense of, um, you know, you have a connection to them, but you don't have title. You don't have the Rain. You don't have rule. You don't have. Um, they don't have a obligation to you. The full card. Yeah. Um, somebody definitely has secret secret plans of wanting to go in a new direction. Okay, wanting to be single, wanting to start at the new a new beginning, go in a new direction, new development, maybe without because all of these cards speak to singlehood, singular plans. Uh, focusing and relying on yourself knowing that a decision needs to be made someone's not serious about a commitment anymore yeah the hangman Pisces you showing up um, so yeah somebody's like so this is when you have to ask yourself okay so how did I get in all of this how how did I play a part in all of this and how do I get out of it and a, a lot of times that is sacrificing something giving up something so that you can move to another place also, this is maybe hands off uh, in terms of moving stuff, you know, uh, moving a relationship or moving um, a conversation ahead. You're hands off. You're waiting. Okay. You're waiting to re-engage. You're just letting stuff go on around you. You're even waiting for the perfect time to jump back in there. Once you have enlightenment about what you need to do next or how you can operate next or how you can lose or how you can retain you know whatever it is you're trying to retain and not lose so much but you know something is going to be sacrificed a relationship person place thing money i don't know something needs to be sacrificed and something will be this is when you ask yourself 
why haven't I had what I really want? So you've taken personal responsibility while gaining enlightenment. Also, you're also um, coming up with a plan of action in terms of what you can do because you're asking yourself, why haven't I had what I really want? So it's all about you and what part you play and not anyone else. Um, if it's that you want to be married or that you want to be coupled or that you want a real relationship, you need to ask yourself a question. Why haven't I had what I really want? If you want a certain type of person in your life or you want to be a certain way or you want to have something, you need to ask yourself that question before you re-engage so that you can have some plan of action in terms of moving forward. Um, yes, it looks like somebody's ready to be single, or ready to have go in a new direction. Yeah, the world card, ready to wrap something up, okay? Um, you could be dealing with a fixed sign or set Aquarius, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio. Somebody's got plans to move away or move from. Also, somebody um, needs to ask themselves why they're in such a very carefree, uh, spontaneous um fun loving connection and if they want more they need to ask themselves why they haven't had more okay so um, enlightenment healing power okay and that's what you need to gain i hope that the reading resonates for you go over to the website book your own reading there take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link thank you pisces many blessings to you